Hello friends, in this video I am going to explain you how to construct an expression tree from the given postfix expression. Okay, so see as you can see that we have one postfix expression which is 43 into 82 divided by plus. Right, so how we can know that it is a postfix expression because the operators are after the operands. These are operands. 4, 3, 8, 2 are operands and the operators are multiplication, division and plus or addition. So see, we have to understand the two steps. First step is if operand is present, if operand, then we have to push it into the stack second step if operator is present if operator then we have to pop two elements so okay from the stack so here the operands uh, in our expressions are 4 3 8 and 2 and the operators in our expression are multiplication, division and addition. So see, first of all we have to create the stack, right? So see here I am going to create one stack. Okay, here it's my stack. Now, we have to scan this expression, okay? So see, first uh, in our expression, first is operator sorry operand okay so see if operand we have to push it into the stack so see we will push 4 into our stack second next character is 3 so 3 is also operand so we will push it into the stack next is multiplication which is operator so see if operator we have to pop two elements right so we can pop 3 and 4 so 3 and 4 okay so 3 and 4 we have popped and which is our operator multiplication so the first popped element which is 3 will become the left child uh, will become the right child of the operator and the second pop element will become the left child of the operator so see after popping we have to insert these operator or the address of this operator again into the stack so see now our stack contains we have popped 3 we have popped 4 and after popping we have to insert this operator so I have inserted here operator okay multiplication address so I will write it in small here so that we can know okay now scan next character so next character is what 8 which is operand so we will simply push into into the stack next one is what 2 which is also operand so we will push it into the stack next next is what well, uh, division so division is nothing but operator so if operator then we have to pop two elements right so now we will pop two elements so 2 and 8 will be popped so 2 and 8 will be popped now what is our operator division so first popped element is 2 so it will become right child and the next popped element is 8 so it will become left child of the operator division okay now after we have uh, popped the two elements we have to push this element again the operator right so here now my stack will contain multiplication is there and then division okay so now I uh, here uh, I will write this also here okay now next scan the next character in our expression so it is plus which is also operator right so now if operator we have find we have to pop two elements from to from the stack so see now we will pop division and next one is what multiplication now first pop is what division so it will become the right child and the second popped element is multiplication so it will become the left child of the plus operator okay after popping what we have to do we have to again push this into the stack okay so we will push it into the stack sorry after uh, we have done with our expression right there is no next character present in our expression so 
we are done with it so see now our multiplication operator contains what this 4 as a left child and 3 as a right child next was division division contains what 8 as a left child and 2 as a right child so in this way now our stack is empty okay so we have to uh, do these steps until we have reached our ex uh, complete uh, until we traverse the whole expression given postfix expression okay so this is the postfix expression tree okay we have constructed the tree from the given postfix expression now to check whether it is a correct or not we have to traverse this tree into the postfix okay so see in postfix what we follow for postfix we first visit the left child then right child and then at last we visit the node so see we will traverse the same tree into this order okay so first see left so left child of this is what multiplication again uh, check whether it is having left yes it is having left so go there now we were are at 4 we, uh, see whether 4 is having left child no so we will visit that node so see we have visited 4 now after visiting left we have to move to the right so see now right is my 3 so see whether uh, 3 is having left child no whether 3 is having right child no so we will visit this so, okay now see the left and right child of this node are completed now we will visit this root okay so now 43 into okay left right and then uh, parent node that is no uh, multiplication after this see we have done with the left child uh, left subtree of this operator now move to the right now see here we are okay at division now see whether it is having left yes it is having left right so we will check whether again it is having left or right child no so we will visit that node now see after visiting we have to move towards the uh, right okay so now see we are at 2 so see now see whether 2 is having left child no so it is not having left child check whether it is having right child no it is not having right child so after the left and right child of both uh, the node is completed we have to print the node okay parent node so we will print this 2 now we have uh, now the left and right child of this operator division operator is visited okay now we will visit this root node that is division now see the left and right both the subtrees or both the childs have visited of this of this addition operator so the last step is to print this operator root node so we will print it so see now we are getting the correct postfix expression right so it means our expression tree is correct so hope you like the video and understand so please do subscribe my channel i will explain you the all the next concepts such as construction of expression tree from the infix and the other videos based on the unit 4 and 5 into the next video thank you